Hello, welcome to Puzzle Master. Today I'm going to be showing you the solution for the Hanayama Elk Puzzle. Which means we're going to show you how you can separate those two pieces and then reassemble them back into its original form. The Elk Puzzle is a level 5 out of 6 on Hanayama's own difficulty scale and it is a level 9 out of 10 on our own Puzzle Master difficulty scale. And if you haven't got the Elk Puzzle already, then you can pick it up from our website, puzzlemaster.ca. And without further ado, let's get straight into the solution. So here's a fully assembled Elk Puzzle. You've got two pieces which are labelled. One of them has Hanayama on the back and one of them has Knob on the back after the designer of this puzzle. Now for, to keep it simple, I'm going to be holding the Hanayama piece with the elk face facing towards the camera the whole time. And all we're going to be doing is moving the knob piece around. Now first of all, we worry the knob piece is going to be upside down relative to the Hanayama piece. And what we're going to do is we're going to take it out to the left hand side, like this. We're going to turn it so that the antlers are facing us. And then what we're going to do is we're going to drop this peg through the middle of the Hanayama piece. And we're going to turn it up into this position here. Okay. And then what that allows us to do is to twist to the left. This peg here will just glide past the Hanayama piece. And we can then separate the puzzles into this position here. And now it's just a case of, of which peg crosses which peg first. Now again, the Hanayama piece is the one facing us. The back right peg is going to be the first one to come over the top of the Hanayama piece, followed by the back left piece there. And then we separate the other two pegs into this position here. And that is how we disassemble the elk puzzle. And to put them back together, we're going to keep the same orientation. This is the Hanayama piece. We're going to keep that facing towards the camera the whole time. And we're just going to be moving the knob piece in here. And to start with, we're going to turn the knob piece upside down. And we're going to have the face of the elk of the knob piece facing left. Then what we can do is we can connect the front two pegs in here. And we reverse the order at which we came apart by going over the underneath the back left hand side first followed by the back right peg into this position here. Then we can drop down and then that back right peg is going to twist through and over the face of the Hanayama piece elk. So we twist around into this position here. Then we turn it so that the antlers are facing us and that back right peg comes through the elk piece or the Hanayama piece into this position and then we come all the way through, we turn to the left and we drop down and we are back in the Elk's original position. So there we go, that is how you solve the Elk puzzle. And it's important that it is the Hanayama puzzle that is facing you and that you've got the exact right positioning with the Elk face of the knob facing the right way. Because those pegs on the top, one of them is very, very slightly shorter than the other. And it's that shortness of that peg that allows that twist when you are separating the, the two pieces. So following that routine, it, it might feel like nothing really skips past each other. Sometimes if you've not got it quite in the right position, it might require a little bit of force. But if it doesn't, then brilliant. Now hopefully this has helped you solve the elk puzzle for yourself. If you want to pick up more puzzles just like the elk puzzle, then you should check out our website puzzlemaster.ca where we have the biggest variety of puzzles on the internet in the world. And until next time, I will see you later.